When we put out the call for the audience to submit questions to Curious Brisbane, one was asked more than any other, why is the Brisbane River brown? While the reasons behind the murky colour are simple, I found there was much debate about whether it can ever be blue. It's the heartbeat of the River City where Brisbane celebrates and recreates. But underwater, Brisbane River isn't pretty. It's a lot more dirty than it would have been uh, back in the 1800s, obviously. Um, but it's by nature a dirty system. But how did it get so murky? Dredging in the 1860s to allow bigger ships into the city is one reason. We dredged the mouth. We went from a metre and a half deep down to about 17 or 18 metres deep. And now the tidal influence is all the way up at Ipswich. The fact that it's an estuary and the effects of urbanisation also have an impact on the colour. When it rains, runoff from hard surfaces like driveways and roofs go straight into the river, taking pollutants with it. Since the water is constantly moving with the tide, the sediment or dirt is forced around rocks, churning over and over like a washing machine. The mud is unable to settle and that's why the water is so brown. Experts say it used to be worse when industry used it as the city's drain, with meatworks dumping fat and offal in the waterway. And with the beach too far away, swimmers took to the river instead. Old timers recall a clean, clear stream and being able to see objects three metres underwater. Scientist Paul Maxwell doesn't believe that's true, but insists the river is safer now than it was. So can the river ever be blue? Well, one man and his team think the answer is yes. Here in Jindalee, they're transplanting a native plant to see if that will help clear up the river. These plants will help keep the mud here. So the river will put the mud onto the mud banks. We'll work to plant these plants, keep the mud here, and the river will clear itself up. Coastal engineer Jesper Nielsen says it can be done in as little as four years. What kind of an army would you need to be able to do that? It'd be a very small army, maybe 10, 15 people. Oh, it's very ambitious. He adds a brown river isn't necessarily bad. Just don't catch fish that have spent their entire life in the river. You can read more about the story on our website. And if there's something you've always wondered about Brisbane that you would like investigated by the ABC, go to abc.net.au slash news slash curious slash Brisbane.